What we're looking at is the uh, Scorpion aircraft. It's manufactured by Textron Aviation Defense in Wichita, Kansas. Uh, and it's a, it's a unique aircraft in that it was designed entirely by Textron Aviation Defense uh, with, uh, to, to fill a market that the company perceived was needed in ISR and light attack. We've uh, we participated, this exact aircraft, uh, NI, as well as another test pilot, uh, participated in the light attack experiment at Holloman Air Force Base. And so it's a, it's a high, hot, uh, dry uh, environment, and we were able to uh, demonstrate the ability to do uh, full takeoff weight missions, uh, still climb to our service ceiling of 40,000 feet, and, uh, and operate in that environment without any problem. On this specific tour, uh, we've been doing demonstration flights all around this region uh, the two weeks prior to getting here, and no nothing about that has presented any problem whatsoever. We've, we've uh, never missed a sortie for maintenance, uh, and we've been able to do uh, lots of different uh, ISR and light strike tasks for a variety of customers, and uh, the weather has not presented any problem for this airplane. Uh, it was designed with the aircraft itself and the navigation system, the Garmin 3000, completely separate from the mission system. So uh, any changes that uh, anybody might want to make to the mission system, whether it's as simple as a change to the HOTAS or as complicated as a complete change out of sensors from electro-optical uh, to SAR radar to some sort of an EW package, whatever you might want, whatever a customer might need, we can do without making any changes to the airframe itself or to the Garmin navigation system. Uh, the two are completely separate, so it gives you the opportunity uh, rather than aircrafts that are so tightly integrated that any change needs to retest the entire system, this gives us the ability to partition off the mission system, do whatever we want or whatever a customer might want, and, and with no risk to the airplane or to safety of flight.